Continuing on the custom card review streak, we're going to be talking about a LR Super Saiyan 2 Kepler. And it's coming in from K, because I don't, don't exactly know how to pronounce the name. But before I go ahead and read K's card, go ahead and send me custom cards over to VHDevCustomCards at gmail.com so I can get to your custom card in the near future in the form of a live stream that I did yesterday. You guys can go check out the live stream I did yesterday. It was pretty, I think it was pretty good. I think it was pretty good. It was fun. I enjoyed it. Personally, and shout out to all the people that swung by and, you know, showed love. Um, but with that being said, I do have to write down uh, K's name. That way, yeah, he made a whole Majin Buu Saga celebration too. I'm looking at it on the paper. <laughs> uh, but yeah, with that being said, K says, Hey Dev, here are some custom cards from Tournament of Power. I hope you uh, will like them. And keep doing great work. K much love i mean gotta give credit where credit's due bro i'm getting sent a thousand custom cards i love you guys it's like i will never not have content to do when it comes to custom cards same when it comes to unit reviews well technically if i review every card in the game which is one of my goals to do on the channel of course um i'd have to wait for another card to come out Unless Doe kind of like shuts down, then I'm not able to do unit reviews anymore. That'd be a day, to be honest. To have like a final card in Dokkan, that's going to be a day. But hey, as you guys know, all good things must come to an end. So, um, with that being said, K, okay, thank you for sending your card. And of course, keep doing great work. You too. I mean, you too, for sure. All right. So, it is a LR Super Saiyan 2 Kefla right over here. I do got to go ahead and zoom in. Let me not forget to write his name and star it when I get a chance. Um, should I cover the categories? Nah, I'm just gonna go ahead and move myself up here. Um, I'm gonna zoom out. Nah, I'm gonna zoom in. I gotta zoom in a tad bit. You guys can see that it's a 200% leader scope for Universal Survival Saga. So, Carnival LR, Super Saiyan 2, Kefla, she is STR, and her stats are shown below. 20 Over 24k HP at 15,290 attack. So she's on the lower end of attack for LRs, of course, for a Carnival LR. And she's at almost 15,000 defense. Okay. So something tells me that she's going to be a defensive card. Okay, so her leader skill is Universal Survival Saga 3 key and 200% across the board. Of course, because she's a Carnival LR. She also gets 50% attack and 30% defense for one turn on her 12 key while doing colossal damage to enemy, so solid. And her 18 key, she gains 100% attack and 30% defense for one turn while doing mega colossal damage to enemy. So she has good super attack effects considering the fact that she's getting defense on super. That's obviously the thing that matters the most considering the fact that we are inside a defensive age of Dokkan because bosses can get you up out of here in, in a timely fashion. <laughs> Look at Goku and Frieza. All right, so passive, uh, anxious character of Fused Warrior. Activates interest animation once only and launches an additional super for six turns when there is another Universe 6 ally on the team. Okay. That is nice that she does have that guaranteed super so she's able to get the additional attack and defense from her 12 key while she's doing her 18 key, of course. Well, after she does her 18 key, pretty much. So she gets six key and 166% attack and defense at the start of turn and she gets one key per key she obtained. Cool. And she also launches an additional attack that has a 50% chance to come with super attack when attacking. And she also gets an additional 166% attack and defense when performing a super attack. Nice, considering the fact that she's getting an attack and defense buff in both her 12 and 18 key super attack effects. And she also gets 33% damage reduction, just unrestricted. And she gets an additional 33% damage reduction before attacking. Okay, so she can get up to 66% damage reduction before attacking. Um, okay, 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 okay. Kit looks... Kit looks solid. I'd say the kit looks solid because this card has a guarantee super built into it for the first six turns and also has additional super attack chance unrestricted. Keep or keys for obtained. Uh, what else do we have here? Up to 66% damage reduction, 166% attack and defense performing super attack and a passive. So attack and defensive buff in her passive to her super attack effects. I would say she looks solid. I'd say she looks solid, but I feel like the only thing this card is missing is I'd say the only thing this card is missing is her being able to build up off of her doing attacks. I feel like if she built up 33% attack and defense up to 166% attack and defense, I'd feel like that'd make her a tad bit better. And also, 
I'd probably also give her, I don't know, maybe like a 50% chance to dodge because is her post super defense with 33% damage reduction going to be enough to take a super attack? I don't quite know. Probably because her defense is at 15, excuse me, not 15, 14,935. That's damn near 15k. She's almost at 15,000 defense rainbowed, right? She looks solid. I would say she looks solid. I would say for sure. Um, that extra 33% damage reduction is meant for her to send inside the first slot and take that first uh, normal slash super attack. But will she take damage before she supers through that 66% damage reduction? I would probably say, yeah, she can probably take a hefty amount of damage depending on the boss and depending on these, these circumstances uh, because she only has 166% defense. And yeah, that's it. She gets all of her defense post super because she gets it 30% 30% defense for one turn and both of her 12 and 18 key super attack effects. She also gets 166% defense when performing a super attack. Um, yeah, that's it. Yeah, I feel like this card is absolutely missing. It's missing this card being able to build up off of doing attacks because you already have the guarantee super built into them or it's built into her, excuse me. You also have the uh, the additional super attack chance built into her kit too um i would probably say i would maybe i would say also reward her for yeah reward her for also having that universe six ally on the team like let her get like i don't know that maybe like 50 percent attack and defense within those first six turns as well as that i don't know i don't know i'd probably still let her build up off of uh, uh just attacks and give her a 50 percent chance to dodge to fall back on because you're going to be throwing her inside the first slot and she'll have if she has 66 percent damage reduction with a 50 percent chance to dodge that's pretty good <laughs> that is pretty good because at least you can fall back on the uh the coin flip of the 50 percent chance to dodge um i think that's it yeah and her link set is super saiyan fuse fighter battlefield diva warriors universe six tournament of power power bestowed by god and legendary power i think the little uh the art is cool by the way just a little shrug Categories, Peppy Gals, Universal Survival Saga, Batara, Pure Saiyans, Full Power, Universe 6. She has a ton of categories. Uh, Join Forces, Super Saiyan 2. That category needs help bad. Final Trump Card, Rapid Growth, Time Limit, Bond of Friendship, Accelerated Battle, Power Beyond Super Saiyan, Fuse Fighters, and Tournament Participants. Yeah, I'd say this card looks all right. I think the only issue is that this card can probably die it could die turn one depending on what what well, can this probably not maybe i'm crazy maybe i'm crazy yeah but i'd probably just give this card uh let, let this card uh, get attack and defense for just attacking and give it a 50 percent chance to dodge if you want to make it a support type unit too to each his own right but yeah uh send me custom cards over to bhf custom cards at gmail.com so i can get to your custom card in the near future i'm getting all these older custom cards out the way uh k thank you for sending your card absolutely um criticisms uh all this card has is 166 percent defense and 66 percent damage reduction before she attacks i feel like her post super defense is probably very high to support her 33 percent damage reduction probably is a hefty word i'm using for that statement yeah which is why i add on that 50 percent chance to dodge that way you know that that 166 percent defense is probably not enough right it probably isn't enough with that 66% damage reduction. Now, if she had 40% damage reduction, as well as an additional 40% damage reduction uh, before she attacks, then you got me. That though, that is definitely gonna help. That's gonna work. I'd probably say that'd work. But yeah, I don't really want to add. Uh, I don't want to tack on any more things about the card. But yeah, um, I appreciate you guys for watching. You guys are the best. Join the 24/7 Discord server. The link is down below in the description for you guys to join the Discord server today. Uh, and leave a life if you enjoyed the video. I'll catch you guys next video again, and I love you all. Peace.